Okay guys, in the last video we left off on the inbox and we left off on this screen. Set up your YouTube username and channel. So we are going to do that now. The first thing we want to do is right over here click on your little icon there. So we're going to go to my channel and then we're going to name this something. Let's see. Say video SEO expert. I like that. And let others find my channel. Yes. Send me occasional product related. Yes. You always want to stay updated with YouTube and their new changes because they're switching on you quick. But um, see right here it says username available. If it wasn't available, it would probably be red. And of course, you can check availability here. But go ahead and click next. And then this is where you set up your privacy and sharing so what you can do is when whenever you like a video comment on a video subscribe to a channel and favorite a video these actions will be shared okay within your channel so people who are subscribed will see what's going on I don't really want people to know what I'm subscribing to I don't they don't need to know any of that so we're all done and then here is your channel see they're still doing upgrades that's okay we can work around it so let's just click next and see what they're taking us through channel feed new distribution center for your channel okay about the new channel blah 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 that's it there you go now if you want more information you see this little URL right here you can I'm gonna open in a new tab it gives you more information pretty cool on how these guys have them laid out so you can come here and kinda of get ideas on how some of the people are laying their channels out. So you have like the creator style, you have the blogger style, you have the network style, and you have everything. It's just a big old clutter, clutter mess there. So let's just dismiss that and then let's start editing our channel. I don't want these pop ups anymore because they're really getting in the way. And we're just going to run through on setting up your channel. We will get into the customization of your channel basically because there's not much to it so I really want to dedicate a lot of time to pretty much setting up the information your avatar and all that good stuff so I just wanted to show you that you can come here and fill out and choose your channel style those those styles we just saw here right there's the blogger style network style so I like the network style and it gives you a preview but obviously we don't have any videos yet we're just going to kind of just go over everything here you can enable your feature tab that way you can have a featured video right in this area and we'll get into all that you'll see it all come together alright so we've done a little bit of editing actually here is part of the setup as well um, the title name WordPress video expert channel and you just put it in the description of what the channel is about I'll leave this for now I'll fill it out in between videos and just come back to it and but the thing is with the description you want to be descriptive you want to use the keywords on what your channel is about okay and that's basically it because you want your channel to be found so you want to make sure that whatever niche you're in whatever whoever you're trying to target that those keywords are prevalent throughout your copy within this description area okay same thing with tags you have to use your keyword rich tags um, and I'll show you all that too we'll actually come in and do that when we start getting more into channels so what I'll do is I'll fill in all this description and then I'll fill in these tags and then we'll come back in the next video and I'll show you and explain to you what's going on there so appearance over here on appearance uh, you can switch back to the old channel design I don't do it because it just becomes more confusing just move on avatar this is where you pick your image um, have all that filled out for you too in the next video and we'll get into uh, channel customization okay so we'll say done editing and over on this side on your channel okay you want to click this edit button here and here is where you want to give a description of what your channel is about again so it's actually like a bio it's more or less telling the people who visit your channel what your channel is about I mean it's just as simple so it will just be like an about page or you know a blog post treat it as like you're trying to rank for the search engines 
all right so that's the about box that you would fill out um, here is your Google Plus ID and you can click show if you want it to be shown you uh, over here you can connect your Twitter account you can connect your Facebook accounts and these are relevant when you are either uploading new videos or liking a video which let me take you back over there so to refresh your memory while we are here let me go to the actually I'm gonna open it up in a new tab so we don't lose our spot here let's see account settings right what are we dealing with here what are we talking about okay connect accounts oops sharing right here so sharing and connected accounts so here you go on connected accounts whenever you upload a video favorite a video like a video comment a video it'll connect and post to these accounts okay on YouTube on connected accounts this seems kind of redundant and what they're asking here because I mean it doesn't make sense but like I say they're still in beta and they are I, they're still working it out but we'll get through it and I believe that this is the final version of their layout so we should be good to go nothing much should change from this point forward okay so I'm just gonna save my changes I'm glad we went there because in the case I do decide to hook these accounts up <laughs> lucky me I won't remember that I had those checked that's what this section right here is for now this is the really cool part about it on the new channel because you can actually add your own links to your other offers so if you have like affiliate offers I'm not sure if affiliate links work in here I haven't tried one not real big into affiliate marketing but this is where you would give it a title and you would put the web address on where to it's going and come more down about this user there's more content you can put here make sure it's keyword rich content so it's kinda it's kinda weird so this is about the channel and then I, they're asking about you the person but I mean just it's pretty much the same if I mean I guess I don't know whatever niche you're in whatever you're doing if you're working for a company and you're the YouTube expert then you would you know about the company I guess and about you the the author or the the YouTube master to webmaster of the channel then that would be appropriate um, this gives you a join date all that good stuff hometown just make sure you just fill out all this information you're asking for occupation here you go once again more keywords and stuff can go in there and you'll see how this is populated when we get into the next video okay uh, companies uh, you put your products here okay if you're selling products affiliate products you know MLM whatever it is you know schools I mean it's just depends on what you're doing I guess if you're selling you know coffee you have a coffee shop I don't think anyone cares that you have a PhD in nuclear science I guess I don't know but here the same um, if you know how to SEO well then you can just I would use this box just to populate it with keywords why not because the more keywords you have on your channel the better um, so I would just if it was me I would just use that school for another section to put content in same thing with companies you know especially for entrepreneur you have your own company put your company in and put a little small description about it then other channels here this just shows you um, what channels you are subscribed to and so when you're all done with that you would just hit apply but obviously it didn't take anything because we didn't put anything in there now we move over to this middle area here under the settings allow channel comments allow channel comments but don't display this is where you set up the comments if you want people to comment I would select don't display until it's approved and then just apply and then it's automatically on feeds oh and I want to show you in edit channel because you can choose your your feature tab now here you remember where we added our we enabled our feature tab now if we were under click that I mean unclick uncheck that and then hit done editing and then we don't have our feature tab anymore we want that feature tab on sorry about that let's go back to feature tab and enable that done editing and now our feature tab is back and then here's where you can add a featured video um, choose a, 
a featured video you can choose a featured video from playlists that you have created or videos that were just straight uploaded you can even check most recent video and feature set other channels again add different channels that you have subscribed to and it will display so let's cancel out of that that's pretty much it as far as setting up your channel oh let's go over videos this is a real quick way on the front end of your YouTube channel to do some things okay instead of always being in the back end of the YouTube channel okay I like the way they did this because it's really user friendly because the most important thing of course is uh, uploading your video um, second to that would be creating a playlist all this other stuff is I don't know extra stuff that I guess if you're into all that then you would um, choose those and be excited about it you can just straight upload here and then it takes you to their uploader okay you can upload multiple files you know record from webcam so when we come back guys we are going to start customizing and start adding some content to our freshly new channel okay see you guys in the next video